Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how you can format a USB flash drive to be compatible with both Mac OS X and Windows and be able to fully function between both. So in this case we're going to be working with a 2GB USB stick and it's just a standard one like you buy in the store. So to work with this flash drive, what we're going to have to do is go into Disk Utility. So I'm going to open up a new Finder window and from here I'm going to go to Macintosh HD, then Applications, and then scroll down to Utilities, and in Utilities will be a Disk Utility, and I can open that up. So in Disk Utility, on the sidebar, you have all your connected drives. So I'm just going to select this, in this case, the 2.12 gigabyte flash disk media, and this is the USB flash drive we're working with. Now, to first of all see what format your flash drive is in, you're going to want to select the Partition tab now when you pick up a USB, it'll probably come in one of two formats, and that is FAT32, which this one is, or NTFS. So if your flash drive is in the NTFS format, you're going to have an issue, and that is that you cannot write files to it from Mac OS X. It'll work fine with Windows, but if you're trying to use it between both, you won't be able to write files from your Mac. So in that case, you'll definitely want to format it. So to format the flash drive, we're going to click on the Erase tab. And from here we see a whole bunch of different formats if we click on this menu. Now, first of all, we have Mac OS Extended Journal. And this is the standard Mac OS X format. And this is great if you're only working with Macs, but if you're going to be working with PCs as well, you don't want to choose this because Windows cannot write to disks that are in the format of Mac OS Extended. So we also have MS-DOS FAT, which is probably the best option you can choose. This is the FAT32 file system. And it's great because it works with almost every device you could ever think of. Uh, be it cameras, any computers, it doesn't matter. It'll most likely work with a FAT32 formatted drive. Now the only thing you want, might want to be aware of if you use this is if you tend to use the versions tool in Mac OS X Lion, the FAT32 file system does not support that, so you won't be able to use it. And FAT32 also has a limit of 4 gigabyte file sizes, so you can't put anything bigger than that on there. And last we have XFAT, which is a newer file system. And the nice thing about this is you can put files on it over 4 gigabytes, but the only problem is it only works on newer computers, so ones running Mac OS 10.6.5 or later as well as Windows XP Service Pack 2 or later. So it's not a lot of compatibility with older machines, which is why if you're going to be working between Macs and PCs, it's best to choose MS-DOS FAT, which is the FAT32 operating system. And then from there you can name it, and we'll name this 2 gigabytes. And then I can erase the disk. And this will format it for me and erase it with the FAT32 file system. So of course now if I go under partition you can see that it has the name and the format which is MS-DOS FAT otherwise known as FAT32. And now your flash drive will be fully prepared to work on both Macs and PCs and it will be in the correct format. So there you go there's how to format a USB flash drive to work on both Macs and PCs. If you have anything that you'd like to see me do a how-to on regarding either iOS or Mac OS X, make sure to send me an email. I hope you found this video useful, and thank you for watching.